In this video, I'm going to show you how you can add a negative numbered frame as the actual starting point for your simulation. In a weird situation where you may want to add something to the beginning of your animation, like in this case, just imagine it's a, a very elaborate physics simulation. And I don't want to rebake it, but I want to put some camera motion or something in it before the actual physics starts. So, let's just say I'm going to go ahead and add 100 frames to the beginning of, of the animation. Now, I can try to move the cursor down here to negative 100 by clicking. It doesn't work. I could try dragging it. It doesn't work. I can go right here and press minus 100, which would be a logical assumption. Press enter, and it just goes to zero. So how do we fix that? Go up here to File, go to User Preferences, and then click make sure you're in the editing tab and then click this allow negative frames now save user settings and you can go ahead and close that now I can go ahead and put the cursor anywhere down here but if I press play it just goes straight to zero so what do I do I go ahead and go right here and then press minus 100 still goes to zero so what do I do now click this now if I drag back back here same thing but if I go right here and press minus 100 then my timeline starts at negative 100 and if I click this to go to the beginning now my cursor is at minus 100 and I press play I got 100 frames before the actual physics simulation part begins but anyway if you have any questions about how to go about doing that this is something that I needed several times and I didn't know how to go about doing it, but I knew it could be done. But anyway, again, if you have any questions, let me know. Later, people.